So the next thing we're going to mess with is the camera settings and automation. And this is really great for doing slideshows, uh, manipulating pictures. So let's get right down to it. What we're going to do first is we are going to paste this picture into our timeline. Stretch it out to at 30 seconds for our purposes. See, the problem is we can't see much of this here. The picture's too big, so we're going to go in. This time we're going to adjust the camera automation and show the tool. And you see here again, you've got your X, Y, and Z. You can also drag this, but since you are dragging the view of the camera, when you go down, it's going to make the image go up. When you go up, it's going to make the image go up. It's just like you're looking through a camera. So just remember that, or you might get a little confused. So let's go back here. Zero these values out. And we are going to want to back this off until we see the whole picture. And there we go. That's all it took. You're going to want to do this when you're doing like picture slideshows rather than having to go through and batch resize everything. It makes it real simple if all your pictures are the same size coming in. You just back it up. So let's add some keyframes. I know I want to end with the thing in full view. And let's say I want to end that at about 10 seconds. Let's say 15. So what we're going to do here is we're going to move down to 0.5 that's where we want to be. That's going to be the end. So we're going to turn on our keyframes. Give ourselves a little bump just to record the position. Oops. There we go. That's where we're going to end up. Now we're going to go back here to the beginning and I want to Zoom in, let's say, two times, and go down here to the corner. So what we're actually going to do is we're going to pan out. Now let's straighten our keyframes. Get rid of our little tool here. And look at our handiwork. So this is cool to do some picture panning if you're doing a picture show. Another thing we can do, delete, is let's go back to the beginning. ourselves up. Recording keyframes. Come over here to the end. And we're going to go over here to the right by Space 1999 and Battlestar Galactica. Now that we've recorded that, straighten the keyframes, go back, and we have got a nice little pan. And you can really go in any direction. And you can go all over the place. Just like in this example, where I use the camera automation to go around a mat I had and the projector automation to project myself up on the mat and green screen. And you can throw this stuff together. This is probably one of the most powerful compositing tools uh, Cinelera has short of adding the effects. You can do all kinds of stuff with it. So here you go. Our next tutorial is going to show you how to do a little picture show and have fun. Do some cool stuff. Let's see what you got.